Yo, what's up, YouTube? TGC Retro here with TGC Spider, bringing you another dual commentary on a 30 and 6 sniper gameplay I get on the map offshore. Uh, wanted to talk a little bit about TGC. Treachery Gaming Community it is a new clan that we've all started together as a bunch of friends, and it's growing pretty quickly. I'm rather shocked on how fast it's growing. Wouldn't you say so, Spider? Yeah, I'm one of the leaders in TGC, and it's just amazing how quickly this clan is actually growing. It's phenomenal. It's We started off with just like five members. We now have 50 plus members in the space of two weeks. It's ridiculous. Mm -hmm. It's been really amazing and I wish I could have been there for more of the recruiting phase but my back surgery kept me out from that which is really sad but you know it is what it is and I'm glad to see that everybody did well while I was gone and making it grow and it's amazing like you said it's awesome didn't think it would get this big already like it is uh, I want to talk a little bit also about Treachery Gaming's new YouTube channel we'll be posting videos up rather frequently too. It's called Treachery Community. It's our new gaming channel that we're using on YouTube. We're going to be posting a lot of gameplays on and me and Spider will be doing a lot of dual commentaries. Tons of dual commentaries. Right now we have like five other gameplays we can use right now for commentating. So expect a lot of content to be posted to that channel. Uh, there will be tons and tons of content on the channel. And Spider will be posting a lot of stuff as well. And vlog with a whole bunch of other members from TGC posting nonstop content. So I expect that channel to get pretty big fairly quickly with how much content we have and going to be posting. So look out for that channel. Go check it out. Try to your community. We'll hopefully also be doing a like little little team montages like OpTic, it's like this slight difference from OpTic obviously because we're TGC so instead of it being OpTic's team tages, it'll be TGC's team tages and it will be lots of good stuff, it won't just be me and Retro we're going to try and get other people in there we are main, the main quick scoping people in, in TGC but we can try and get some regular gun clips in there as well Definitely. I would like to try to get some more quickscopers involved. Maybe more people quickscope trained per se so we can get more team Todges going for quickscoping. Because the red gun clips are the standards for red gun clips is immense. I mean, it's, it's ridiculously high. I would love to get more quickscopers for sure. Definitely be good for the channel, I think. But yeah, like I said, check out Treachery Community, guys. It's going to be a great channel. Uh, another thing I'd like to talk about... Oh, sure. what's that? Who was this guy that was talking to you on Twitter again? Optic Hex. Hector Rodriguez. Uh, like I said, I, I just made my Twitter two days ago and uh, started following him. And I just tweeted him once. And the guy just started talking to me, having a conversation with me on Twitter. And I think that's amazing. I wanted to talk about that a lot because someone of that standing that is that busy with optics and doing all of everything they do, I'm sure that he has to deal with every day. And having the time to be able to sit down on his phone or whatever he was doing it on and having a conversation with me on Twitter for like an hour was awesome. You know, I mean, props to Hex. I mean... Shows what kind of guy he is for his status. Most guys like that don't even give people time of the day like that. You know what I mean? They see it, but they don't say anything. They, they might like it or something or anything like that, but they don't sit there and actually talk about it or talk to you about it. And, I mean, this guy was just awesome. Greatest guy ever. Really cool. Wish I could meet him in real life. He'd be a cool guy to meet. What do you think about Hex? Or Spider? I also think he's an amazing guy. I mean, he runs Optic. It's just phenomenal how he does what you said. It's like 
how can you run a major con on speak to members of the public like Retro here? It's just phenomenal. And it's amazing. He's he's doing MLG all the time. GB is live streaming all the time. And, you know, with Machinima all the time. I mean, he's got a full plate every single day on what he has to do. And he's been doing so much for the gaming community, guys. So much. He's been making the FPS scene huge for a very long time. And mad props to Hex. He's my man for sure. Through and through. He has a little girl as well as mine. And that's what we were talking about a little bit on Twitter. And, you know, the guy just understands my point of view. You know, we're both two guys that have daughters, and we game. And it's awesome. We have a lot in common talking about it. So it was really neat talking to him. Really great guy. Wish I could talk to him more. Hope to see him at the next MLG event. So, yeah. But Hex is a good guy. Shout out to Hex. Thanks, buddy. Uh, another thing I want to talk about, guys, is... My passion for YouTubing and how long I've been wanting to do this and be able to do this for a very long time. I've been playing games since I was like 10 years old, always into the FPS scene, Counter-Strike, all that stuff for a very long time. And I've always wanted to be able to go onto YouTube and post videos like we are doing now. And it's a dream come true, it really is being able to get all the equipment I've been able to get in the past year and being able to really focus more on my YouTubing and it's amazing and I'm glad I've got this new clan and my buddy here Spider that's backing it up 100% in here and it's awesome everybody else is getting good gameplays and being able to post up content and it's just awesome and I want to bring more of a variety of gaming to the channel as well like have you guys you guys have all seen my slender gameplays, my wife's slender reactions, my sisters. And I wanted to start posting some more other gameplays like that. Counter Strike, uh Day Z, uh tons of other gameplays like that. Just a variety to the channel. But I do appreciate everybody that's backed me up one hundred percent in this. I mean this is my passion, this is something I really want to do. And it's gonna be awesome. T G C and Tetri community channel is going to blow up big, I think. For sure. What are your thoughts on that, Spider? I actually agree with you 100%. I mean, I love gaming. I started Xbox Live Gaming about two years ago, like I said in a previous commentary. It's phenomenal in I met you back in the ROG days, and ever since then we've just been tearing it up on car. It's been a phenomenal experience. It's just amazing. I hear you, dude. It's been it's been definitely a really good experience with all of you guys. I can't thank everyone in TGC that has stuck around enough and getting pretty much me and my Twitter and YouTube and everything to where it is right now. So big thanks to all of you guys. You guys have been a big help. Much appreciated. Uh, another thing, you guys, I want to talk about. Okay, in this gameplay, I picked up the L118, and it, this is, it's only level 3 in this game. I just picked it up. I only played with it for a little bit. I don't play with it often. But I have honestly forgotten how beastly this sniper rifle is. I mean, it is definitely one of the best snipers in the game, in my opinion. I like it better than the MSR already, and I've been using the MSR a lot more than it. I mean, I don't know what it is. This is my, like, second game with it, and I picked up this gameplay. And right here, there was a host connection problem. Ooh, guy right in front of me, and I still pick him off. But like I was saying, guys, L 18 I think it's the best sniper in the game. I like it. What do you think, Spider? I can't not agree with you there. I hate that gun. It zooms up too quick. <laughs> if I had a, a slower zoom, it would be better, but I'd have to stick to MSR. I was using the L the L eleven eight A today when I was just having a muck about in COD well before we commentated this. 
and I just could not use it at all. It zoomed up too quick. It, it was just ridiculous. I couldn't do it at all. I see that. I don't know why, but I don't know if it's because I didn't snipe for a while, and then I just picked it up and started using it again. But it's now my main snipe rifle, guys. I started using it yesterday. It's already level 29 on my way to gold. And, I mean, I love it. It's a great gun. It's freaking just awesome gun for sure. Uh, I would suggest you guys to try it out for those of you who don't. But that's the end of the gameplay, guys. I go 30 and 6 sniping on Domination on Offshore. If you like it, leave a like. And also subscribe to my channel and also Treachery Community. Check it out. Like I said, it's going to be good. This is TGC Retro and TGC Spider. We're out. Peace. Later.